and today here to talk about this Meccano 9550 motion system 50 best of not quite sure what all you're supposed to say all those things in but anyway cracking set uh, no longer in production Meccano made it round about year 2000 couple of years either way behind it you can pick these up on eBay for at the moment in the UK somewhere between 40 and 50 pounds including postage right as we speak there's two advertised on eBay that you can pick up for that and I have to say that's immense value for what you get in this compared to what you would pay for a much smaller new set you can buy these at the end of the day they're still you know the same parts the parts took particularly um where because they're 20 years old that's still virtually a new mechano part if it's been looked after and you you know 50 decent sized models i like this set so much that i've actually got two of them possibly three because i think there's such good value i've made a few models up out of it um which will trees pitch off um, as we go along and uh yeah let's get it open and show you what's in there so when you open it up this is what you've got um it comes in a polystyrene box that you can see there fill this up i've actually taken the pieces out and stuck them all in an organ organizer tray which is what you've really got to do because these are okay for presenting them but to keep them in any kind of order buy yourself one of these about a tenner i always say at this point that it's, it's a good buy and it is it keeps you somewhat organized it's not quite big enough isn't this tray for the uh, power tool and the wheels and the motor but you know everything else there's a lot of small parts in there and if you don't have an organization system you're gonna lose them there's a lot of parts here it says 605 parts that's probably counting all these nuts and bolts and, and one has been individual parts which is is cheating a bit but even so that's that's a good number of parts for a Meccano set it's, it's a decent size um, you get this power tool which uh, no batteries in it at the moment but Oh, maybe there is. Uh, to be honest with you, never been that impressed. I've never really used them, you know, much easier with just the uh, normal driver and doing it from that. These are a, a bit of a gimmick more than anything else. But comes with it. If you do want to use it, then great. Um, yeah, and as I said, some great models you can get. This is the... Ooh. <laughs> this is the instruction booklet. 50 best of them, 50 models in there. Good clear instructions. As you can see, you let's put you down because you clearly don't want to live there anymore. So there we go. Good clear instructions, part by part. You know, you can't go wrong with these. They are quite complicated models, but the instructions are, are nice and clear. And you know, they, they come together well. What I'm gonna do today is make up this model you can see it on the cover which is the uh it's it's a truck mounted crane of some sort i'm not quite sure how practical that would be on a a day-to-day -day basis because just looking at the picture i don't think that rotates at all so all that i could be wrong let's see when we've got it made up but it's the model to put on the cover and that's what i tend to make up when i'm doing these things so there we go Before we go any further guys, just a, a quick word from today's sponsor. Sponsor of today's video is me. Do you really think any other buggers stupid enough to put any money into doing this? But what you could do for me is click your subscribe button, click a like, leave a comment, just you know, give me some encouragement like that. That'd be massively appreciated. Thanks very much. Before we get on to building that, let's show you one I've got built up. As I mentioned, I've got more than one set of this, um, and this is a model that I've had built up for a while. You might have seen it in the background of my videos previously this is a an apache helicopter well i think it's, they don't actually give them names in the model but that's, I think it's, that's what it's supposed to be uh i think it's a, a really cool looking model actually um the batteries are dead in it because it's been stuck for quite a long time but if you get it going well enough that's supposed to go around um and the rear one is i say supposed to do because it doesn't honestly work that well there's a little bit too much resistance for this type of motor to work around but you know you can do it manually and it's a i like it i think it's a really nice model we'll probably eventually take it down and make something else out with it but for the time being this is pretty cool if you of my generation you might remember airwolf and i, I like to think it's something like that so yeah bring it up for you to have a look at 
There he is. Because I'm about 10 at that. So, yeah, there we go. I'll show you some pictures of some other models that I've made along the way. So, looking at the photo in the manual, which is that's the complete one together, I guess. And what you've basically got is you've got a trailer with a crane mounted on top and then the uh, tractor unit at the front. So, three distinct parts, basically. <laughs> So this is the completed model. I think it looks quite nice as a model but would have zero functionality as an actual crane because there's no turntable on it. So you can do that and you can lift the hook. that. You can, well you can eventually lift the hook, trust me on that, with that. But there's no way of um, turning that crane so you're always going to be on top of your cab so yeah it looks all right but it's got a way to go before it would actually be of any use to anybody if you want pictures of some of the models i've built as well um there's a video coming up of uh, the meccano fly which here we are and there's also a few stills of a forklift truck that was made using this set no neither of those two are in existence any longer so i can't show you them now but that shows you a little bit more of what can be made all in all, as I say, I think it's one of the best value sets you can buy out there. It's 40 or 50 quid that will be well spent if you want to buy yourself a decent Meccano set. So, hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one. Thanks very much.